fatherly wisdom. Today we're at Indian Lake in White Cloud, Michigan, and we're going to do a little bit of foraging. Okay, so the first plant I noticed when I was here is these nice red leaves. It's a huckleberry bush. Now the huckleberries aren't in season, but I've identified it so I can come back when they are in season and pick berries, which we usually do when we're here. Okay, so the next one I'm gonna show you here is a wintergreen. They're yummy. And wintergreens get these little red berries on them. The wintergreens you can find most of the year, and the leaves make a suitable tea, and you can also eat the young leaves, but they're a little tough. But the nice thing about them is they're easy to identify because when you break them open, they smell like wintergreen. The berries taste like wintergreen. They're a little bit on the mealy side though. Okay, so this plant right here looks a lot like a dandelion. Both the leaves and the flower look a lot like a dandelion. They're a little less bitter than a dandelion, and they're called a cat's ear plant. So of course, anywhere you go, you find dandelions. Now the flowers are already gone for the year. You can eat the greens, you can eat the uh, stems, and you can eat the roots. They make a coffee substitute out of the roots. If anybody has a recipe that makes these things taste good, I need you to comment it because I've been trying for years and they're gross. Here with these tiny white flowers is a chickweed, which is edible and uh, has a very light taste. It could be added to a salad easily. As always at this campground, we had a great time and found a few good plants. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe.